What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back. My name is Sam Pro Gamer, and we have some gameplay here of the map Gauntlet, the one that has three maps in one, and it has the three environments: the jungle, the rainy city, urban, and then the Sub Zero Arctic Zone. And I'm in the Sub Zero Arctic Zone right now. I'm running around with spikes here. I like how the graphics are looking in all these maps. I did check them out, and I have high expectations for these maps because, to be honest, Call of Duty is getting a little boring. Hopefully these maps can bring some life to block ops 3 now we're running here on the jungle now this is a famous one with the trailer that he uses his active camo and then he gets a nice two kills here hopefully it does work with active camo i'm definitely gonna try it out when this map comes up and now i'm heading this way and right here to my right we have the three specialties and they're all scattered around the map i think i've seen a couple ones starting off the game and then we have this big guy here again and now we're gonna head towards this rainy city urban as you guys can see it, it's raining like in the trailer and it's kind of cool that Treyarch has implanted these scenarios to it here's a famous run wall and obviously there's nobody here so we get nothing I did notice these two windows here on both sides of the map which you can camp and you get a nice view to the other side of the map and hopefully we don't get a lot of campers abusing both of these spots now we're back in to the spawn of the other side of the map and here's the layout of the map gauntlet and you guys can definitely see the three lane structure the classic three lane structure that call of duty always used for their maps back in the day i feel like they're using it in some maps from block apps we are doing the same thing you guys can see here the three lane structure which is the sub zero arctic zone this rainy city urban and then the jungle of course i don't want to say this is a big map i want to say it's more of a medium map because it's not too small like nuketown here's the famous wall run from the trailer as well in the sub zero arctic zone as you guys can see here like i said this map is pretty cool make sure to check out my other videos out i'm gonna be going over all the maps that has been released in the awakening trailer and if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to slap that like button my name is sam pro gamer and i'll catch you guys on my next video peace right now ain't nobody fucking with a sound right now Right now